Hey, so the other day I shared something with you um, that I went to my, I had a doctor's appointment and at the very end of the appointment, she, we were kind of go, going over some things and she said to me, when, after I told her that I had, uh, I've been using cannabis and um, magic mushrooms, um, she said to me, well, I'm going to advise you not to use those. And I asked her and she gave me some crazy reason, but then the appointment was over and I kind of left it at that. Well, today I talked to her on the phone and I asked her point blank why I should stop. And we're going to talk about that right now. <music> Hey there, Dr. Dave, welcome back. Microdose You, how are you doing? I appreciate you being here with me. So I had um, a conference call scheduled with my doctor today to go over something that was unrelated to this. But at the very end, um, I, I, didn't, I just didn't want to let this go and, and not knowing and not having closure to this whole thing. So at the very end of the call, I said, I, I, doctor, I want to ask you, another question it doesn't have anything to do with what we're talking about now but it's something that happened uh, last week and I just I, I just feel I need to need to hear more of an explanation so she said sure anything anything so I said well I mentioned to you that I use cannabis and magic mushrooms and your recommendation to me was to stop and I wasn't really clear on why you recommended you said because it could lead to other things but we all know that's not the case I'm 67 years old and, and it's not good I have no interest in doing other dr hard drugs or, or hard drugs at all because I don't consider cannabis or magic mushrooms addictive or or hard drugs in any way I think they're pretty darn safe but I said but so tell me I, I said I'm just curious I, I just need to feel like we have some closure on this tell me and if you want to keep this off the record, it's okay. But tell me why you feel I should not be using these, this plant medicine. And she, her answer was she she didn't felt she didn't know exactly what to say, which leads me again leads me to believe that this is kind of part of a playbook here, and uh, it's just it's 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 what she says to anybody that would say this. But um, she started going into this whole thing about well, you know. Um, since this is not FDA approved and, and you were not sure of exactly what you're getting and, and there could be, you know, it could be impurities or additives or she started going that route. And I said, okay, I, 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 I get it. I think you kind of have to say this, but, but um, again, I, I, I don't feel there's any problem with this whatsoever. I, I, I know my source. And, and I said, but you did say something to me last time about your, your worry that this could be like gateway type drugs and, and, and uh, I, it could lead to something else. And she said, no, no, that I, I said that, but it, maybe that's not the right word. She said, but it, it, you know, in somebody younger that could happen. I said, yeah, but you know something, look, I, I've, I've got no interest in, in, in getting into different types of drugs. I'm using these definitely for um, medical reasons. And she said, she said, I know, she said, I know because of, because of this plant medicine, you've been able to totally get off of all of your, um, any kind of antidepressant or benzo or anything. I said, I said, absolutely. I owe everything to this plant medicine. And she said, okay, it's, it's good. But I think she's, she still kind of indicated that she can't like officially give me like the, the green light and say, oh, this is wonderful go for it just do whatever she it was it was not a um contentious um discussion it was not it was not um you know it was very friendly and 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 to the point and and there was never any like you know i'm i'm upset with you or either way uh it was it was it was a good conversation but but i don't think we really got anywhere and i think at the very end i just said okay i said i i I, I get it. I'm 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 okay. I'm okay with that. And we and we just left it at that. Now she is my primary care physician. My psychiatrist that I go to here in Salt Lake City, which by the way I go to now once or twice a year just to kind of 
just to kind of touch base. That's all. I, I don't need talk therapy at all. It doesn't doesn't really do anything for me. But I'd like to keep in touch with him. So I go like maybe once or twice a year. He is all in favor. Now remember, he's a psychiatrist. He said he's a he's an MD. He's been trained in a, at a medical school for four years plus residencies and post grad and all that stuff. So so he's he's the real deal, and he is all in favor of you know, plant medicine and microdosing. I've got another doctor that I see in Dallas, Texas, and um, she's all in favor. She's all in. She said, this is incredible. There are a lot of studies, but it seems like my doctor here in Salt Lake City, and I do love her a lot. I, I, she's wonderful. and She's helped me in so many ways. I still think she's a little bit old school in um, relating to or, or recommending or, or embracing this, this type of plant medicine. And I, I, I don't hold it against her. Some of you have said, well, I would switch doctors immediately. I would, I would walk out the door. No, no, it's, it's no, she's been so good to me in so many ways. I'm not going to do that. And, and I think she gets it. I get it now. Um, and it, it kind of, I hate this expression, but it is what it is. And she's, she's been so wonderful in so many ways. So I'm not going to hold that against her at all, but I wanted just to come on and share with you. I did ask her point blank today, point blank, please explain to me why you don't think I should be using any of this plant medicine. And, and in my mind, she did not have a good reason. So I want to end it at that. Uh, I love her. Um, hope this helps you. Hope it gives a little bit of, at least a little bit of closure to this crazy little episode I had. Um, and that's all I had to say today. So thanks for being with me. Th thanks so I really appreciate you. And um, I know I don't want to date any of these episodes, but I will say to you, whatever you celebrate, if and whatever you celebrate, have wonderful holidays, and we will definitely talk soon. Do love you. See you later.